All right, let's just go ahead and get started. Uh, I got to turn my volume back up. Turned it down last night. Hopefully it's not going to be too loud for anybody. Seems like you guys are all in here anyways, uh, chatting and whatever else. Uh, seen we got, let's, we got, uh, SimStation, Fender, uh, Dairy Deer. How we all doing? Uh, we got Nate in here, Fearsome Rhino. Justin Downey. Farmer C, how's it going, Colin? Benny. Uh, we got Rev. Rev stayed up. It's about midnight, I think, his time or something, or 1 o'clock. I can't remember what he was going to say, but he made it. Uh, Benny said he missed them station stream. Yeah, you're going to have to go back and watch that, Benny. What were you doing? Were you, like, at school or something? How you doing, Ryan? Eric? Farmer Boy 99 Jeremiah? Logan? How are we all doing, guys? So, I, I don't remember where I was at. Where was I? Let's see. I think we were planting corn last stream. Um, the farm's been busy. Imagine doing that. <laughs> I literally propped you up in the window while I was moving calves. Um, yeah, we got equipment everywhere. Things have been going on. We actually put up, bought a pickup head for the chopper because we we're, we're burning through silage. Um, and hay, to be honest, this shed was full. Um, and we're burning through hay. So the cows are eating a bunch, which is fine. Having to do adult and watch the stream. Oh, okay. I, I don't know how old you are, Benny. But we got 50 cows. I want to... Uh, we're here in June 1, but pretty much the end of the day. I want to try to skip forward because... Uh, seems to be tough. Yeah, same. Like, I'm always doing something, Rev, when I got it up. But anyhow, so... The, he the headline for the stream is Dairy Expansion. So I... One night I placed my cow barn down. Look how much of a hill this is. I could not get this thing to terraform. And look nice. Like I redid it like three times and I just couldn't... I couldn't get the dairy barn to fit here. Uh, let's see if anything... Yeah, nothing we need there. But if we grab the the big cow barn which I don't have finished yet but you know I was just gonna get it placed like I had it I think like this I get such a steep I couldn't cut it enough to get it to go so I think what we're gonna actually end up doing and you'll notice we got a new silo already because we needed some place to put um, haylage because, like I said, we we're running out of silage. I think we're going to put the dairy barn, like, right here. So once we get the wheat taken off, then we're going to, like, square this up or so. And we're going to put the dairy barn back here. Machine sensor is on. Wait on the road. I think so. Bean harvest is on. It's a huge... F yeah, Rev. It's just... It's enormous. I mean, it's, it's... It was a lot. It's a lot to try to get it to place down nicely so I think yeah we're gonna end up putting the dairy barn back here um and I already did her away with all the I could redo the pasture there but I don't know what we're gonna end up doing yet but over here uh maybe put a I'm gonna put my shop in um I just don't know where to put it like I thought about getting rid of this barn um and put in the shop here. You know. Fit it up in here like this. But I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it yet. I'm not sure. It's not just white. It's not white. It can be any color. Uh, lots of colors. Lots of changing colors, but... Yeah, I don't know. If I put it anywhere, maybe it would go there. Like, I was thinking the Quonset, but then I got the side door, so. Maybe I put it something like this. 
I don't know. The problem is it's such a hill over here. Oh, the white dairy barn. So the dairy barn is also... I've redone it. It's now metal and it's color changeable as well. Uh, so yeah, I've changed it as well too. You're a sucker for a white barn? Hey, no, how's it going? Logan, uh, Oregon, how are we doing tonight? Hopefully everybody's doing well. But yeah, I want to get in the wheat harvest. That's why I'm kind of wanting to get in July. And I don't know why. Uh, maybe Fender or somebody. My alfalfa has not came to harvest yet. So it's uh, still need harvest. Anyhow, let's get on to the next day. Well, we need to check the cows first. Actually, I think we need to mix some cow feed. Because, yeah, we're down to 5,000 liters. There, so we got, uh, yeah, we still got 60 plus the bowl. We're going to need a, probably a tractor for the mixer. The white has come in just clutch. She's been doing all kinds of work. It's been a nice tractor so far. Um, Yeah, let's just, uh, let's just put the a little agco on the, on the mixer. Uh, and I, I guess I'll use manual attach tonight. Some of you, I know, some of you guys like to use that. Hey, Jay Swizzle, Jay Graham, how are we doing? Tattered, tattered, dirted. No, um, alfalfa maybe. I'm hoping that with uh, enhanced animals, they'll use. Alfalfa. Look at this. We got the barnyard just full of silage wagons. Like this is how it realistically would be, right? You just pull them in. You're like, unhook that thing. Let's get these out of the way for mixing feed. I keep wanting to make them so you can attach these. I don't think you can back these up and hook them onto each other. Uh, we gotta come back a little bit. But how are you doing tonight, Rev? Hopefully you're doing well. Too much orange on this farm? Dairy, you don't even know what's good for you. Okay, we don't need the PTO as long as I can still pull it. Yeah. How's the pivot going, Dairy? You guys getting that figured out? Hey there, Waylon. How are you? Hey, Bent. How are we doing? Hey Aaron Ashlock, how are you? Jake? I asked everybody if they wanted me to run John Deere and everybody said no, stay at the orange tractors. I was willing to make this an all John Deere farm. Uh, Derry though, while you're here, I know you and AT Farms are, I think it was both of you, but I keep dying to get the cat combine. Just because I want to try it out. Like, I like the gleaner. It's fine, but. Just because I want to try something different. Um, er Eric and I guess, who else said they had problems with it? The alfalfa. So, I was going to chop the alfalfa for haylage. But then I got nervous that the uh, silo wouldn't take alfalfa silage so and I didn't want to edit it to make it do it so that's why I chopped the some of the hay or grass hay because I wanted to I wanted to make sure I, you know I didn't not chop it and then didn't have enough feed so I think what we'll end up doing is we'll grab so it takes 45 percent I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a bale of hay in first then we'll back up and we'll grab some haylage and we'll grab some corn silage. So we'll use a little bit of each. Um, kind of pull off of both the silos. I think that's how we're going to do it. But if I don't put the bale in first then it won't, uh, I won't know where I'm at, kind of. 18, they're going to work on that pivot at some point. We found some stuff that won't work. There you go.
Derry and I added the cornet from the cat combine to the gleaner. I got it done, but I need to ask permission from. Oh, I, you got no problems for me. I don't know. You don't need anything from me. Oop, I ran right in the silo. Okay, yeah, I'm not sure, Eric, what it would do. Ah, uh, we're just running into everything because I'm trying to read my. I don't have my. I got my chat down lower tonight. All right, let's get a bale. Yeah, we also got uh, a bunch of bales out in the field because I only chopped like the outside rounds. So we come here. There we go. That's gonna drop us a bale out. We're probably gonna need more than one because. Mixer only holds like 12,000 liters, and we need like 30,000 to get through the day. We're gonna need some bigger equipment if we're gonna expand the cows, that's for sure. But I think, what did I say that barn was gonna hold like 300 or something? So, yeah, we're definitely gonna need some more. We're gonna need some more. Da well, that was the other thing. I need to figure out what we're gonna do for bales because this little 50 bale thing is not going to work long term. I wasn't sure how to place this to make it work. I don't know that I'm going to like it. I assumed I was just going to back underneath of it. Maybe I need to remove the triggers a little bit. There we go. So if we get this to about... I think we're at 54%. So if we get to 75%, and we'll top it off with corn silage yeah it's definitely a struggle especially when it's like up or down instead of up it's kind of not in a good spot for me so yeah now we got our haylage in there maybe I didn't put our silo in a really good spot it was kind of an impulse I was like man where am I gonna put I don't want to put the haylage on the corn silage I knew we were gonna need another silo Figured out asking first to try. Some really nice bale sheds. Yeah. That or I just build my own bale shed. I kind of have an idea for a bale shed. But I need to mess with something. Because, I know, I, I think I've talked to somebody else. I want to see if I can get the bales to stack the other way, like um, more this way instead of being up and down like this. I want to see if I can rotate it uh, and make it look kind of different. I'm not sure how it'll work. But I was trying to look for the bale, well, I think it was Jeremiah or somebody was telling me. Oh, I don't have the PTO hooked up. I'm like, why is this not working? There we go. Um, yeah, I was trying to look for the baler so that whenever you're bailing it stops you, but I couldn't find it. I don't know what it's called. Yeah, in Sim Station, you were talking about how it puts the feed down. That's just the uh, dynamically loaded thing. I think my uh, barn will do that too. You can see it's doing it in here too. It's a little bit maybe more so in that freestyle barn, but. I think it's what you were using the feed so far. Yeah, Ben, but it might be a different type of auto load. Do I keep moving it that much that it's that touchy? Also need to get into that other cow project for this map that I want to get into. Holy mackerel, yeah, we only got 17,000. So we need 31,000 to get through the day. I lowered the slurry amount they make by like half, because I'm like, and I think even the manure. Oh yeah, you can't see the manure, but 
Because, my gosh, these things were full manure, or, and they're still full of slurry. But they are making so much slurry, I'm like, oh my gosh, how am I ever going to keep up? Okay, we'll grab some corn silage. We need about, uh, what do we need? About 25, I think. 25 corn silage. Which, that seems really heavy and hay, but it's just easy to throw a bale in it. I guess we're using, um, silage. Haylage wouldn't. It's a lot of hay, it seems like. Hey, farm bros. It's going good. Hopefully it's going good for you. Hopefully everybody's having a good night. I don't know, is it snowing for most people? It's snowing here fairly good. Yeah, I know, I do need a few farm hands. Somebody just to mix feed. This is getting out of hand with all this mixing of feed. I should have just wet wrapped the bales. That's what I should. I didn't even think about that. I should have bought an Anderson thing, uh, a bale wrapper, and I should have just wet wrapped bales. That would have been just as easy. Hey, scooter. How you doing tonight, scooter? So 46% because I think these bales are 54%. Getting to be dark here on the farm. Then we'll go to our little bale thing, pop us out another one, which hopefully should get us through the night. We're definitely getting into a lot of feeding, though. This is a lot different than like Sim Stations on the map. He's doing a lot more grain farming, we're just doing a lot more. Dairy, but look at that bank account. I don't know if you guys noticed, we're at 532,000. You know, not trying to rub it in or nothing, but. Okay, so I have this problem every once in a while. It's not, to me, I guess I could do this. I'll take it back off. What I had been doing is just unloading the uh, TMR with the easy dev and then adding it back in. So we've already mixed it. But if I drive past the trigger or I drive in the cow barn it'll take the bale and then add hay and then it won't ever use that hay it'll just use my capacity because the way the map works you have to use I think it uses the highest percentage thing first like so we have TMRs at a what if it feeds at 110 percent so it feeds off this first, then it would go to either if it had hay or... Because I still have corn in here, and they won't use it yet. And even though it's 90% until that hay's burned off. I don't really know how to change that, but... Scooter... No snow here? You're lucky. I always have trouble with the Anderson reference. Send the bales into the atmosphere. Hey, Fit Gen Farms. Yeah, you poor grain farmers are on vacay. You're getting new equipment all the time. We're running these old new haunts. So yeah, I was gonna ask you if you're still here, Dairy Deer. Like, I think the chopper's probably what I'm gonna upgrade next. At some point, I should say. What claws chopper would be like newer than that New Holland, but still like is would this is this little chopper worth using? I mean, I. I have it, but I don't know. I mean, I obviously have these. Um, yeah, I'm just wanting something little, like we'll run maybe a six row. But still maybe be able to pull wagons if I want, but not spend a fortune. Holy, 165,000. Gee, Louise. But yeah, this is a 2001. I don't need a big one, so that one might work. At some point, would this be a good upgrade for the chopper dairy? What, what would be your recommendation? Semi. Uh, this quarter. Hey, Duane Baker, how you doing, buddy? Is 
Seven inches in western Wisconsin. Holy macaroni. Okay, so we're at 29,000. That should get us to morning. And we got about 9,000 in there. We'll turn the skid loader off. It's amazing how good them lights look, huh, there, Scooter? So yeah, it's a Scooter. Scooty Pooty, that's his light right up there. I don't know why. I thought I had put two on here. But there's only one. I need to add another one. A medium sized. I've been medium sized here from running the cloth chopper in Pennsylvania. I'm guessing, yeah, I'm guessing dairy must have backed out. I'm just curious, yeah, if I should run that 830. Because I'm not saying the New Holland doesn't work fine, but it's just running a four row chopper. And we're going to have to add, like, I think we're going to have to add, like, two more silos. I'd really love to make, like, a taller, some taller ones. <laughs> I'm going to say poop. They do. They poop so much. What did we make last night? 34,000, about 35,000 in milk. 35,000 in milk. Uh, let's check that used market. Ooh, look at that. Four row corn head. That would fit the John Deere chop. We might as well buy the X9. I mean, we could we could get this. It's only 318,000. Uh, we got the money. What do you guys think? Should we buy the X9? We're not grain farming yet, I guess. Um, oh yeah, I like to show them finances. Look at all this positive, we're just making money. What do we construct? Oh, we built the silo. That was 55,000. 5,000 in a new vehicle. I don't remember what I bought. That was 5,000. Um, milk, yeah, we're up to 69,000 for the month. So we, you know, I'm using, uh, the regular helpers. Oh, I guess I have been using course play. And I've been paying them, so we got 1,800 so far, and then whatever miscellaneous is. But yeah, we're not. We we have not made our loan payment. Just kind of showing you guys what's been going on with the farm. So we still owe about 217,000. But I really think we're kind of by the shaft equipment. X9 is definitely big time. Yeah, Derry, but which one? Like, I'm wondering, is the 830? Nah, I don't even remember what my choppers were. Like, would that be what I want to run? Like, this 830? Like, I just want an older one. That would fit the farm. Just be a small six-row machine. Do some haylage. Or, I mean, I know this isn't yours, but I mean, is this, this is probably more EU or something, right? I don't know if that's American or not. And it's running a it's running a six row head as well. Well, your chopper doesn't have any heads. Hmm. This is what I really want to run the f this combine right here, just because I want to try it out. Near to see someone close, we sent them out to Curd Factory. Small world, you guys know knowing each other. Oh, we need to check the cows. Um, so they got feed. They're uh, pretty much out of feed again. We might as well just start the morning off with the dairy chores, you know, feeding the cows. So we'll fire up a skid loader. Get him warming up. Get ourselves a bale out. Uh... Get ourselves a bailout for the morning. Fire the egg co up. I don't know why it seems so. Unless I didn't check, like. Hold on, let me check something. I bet I messed something up. I don't know if you guys still hear me or no.
Can you still hear me? 5X, I, I know. I slowed it down because I was taking screenshots. All right, gal. Okay, I don't know if you guys could hear me or not. Yeah, I know, five. I need to speed my time up. I slowed it down because I popped in to uh, create a thumbnail and then I didn't want the time to run out because I wanted to be at the end of that day. But you're right, I, I generally play. So yeah, I didn't have uh, cast and receive shadows, but now I fixed that. So now it looks more realistic. You could Okay, I did I wanted I wasn't sure if when I backed out if it stopped capturing it. Yeah, it looks so much better. So much better. Okay. That's that's nice. Well let's put our bail in first, that way we don't have that same bail problem. I got the mixer on. BRB, you better be bringing me some food if you're BRB. And if you're this close, you might as well stop over at Ryan's. There we go. Mixing that hay for the day. We need to go down and get the bales out of the field. Okay, so we got our... Just for the sake of the stream, we're just going to use all corn silage. Even though I think we're getting pert near being out. Pretty close to being out of corn silage. I need to rework that a little bit. Like bring the chute up a little bit and then like maybe a little spout on the end of it. Get rid of this door on the bottom. Maybe raise it up a little bit and then put a spout that would like fill right into your TMR. Oh, I didn't even realize there was scales on this. That's sweet. Did you guys know that? I didn't say little Debbies. I just said food, right? Worked as a man in a retail store for six months and moved to a new store in Men Menemonia before getting back on the farm full time. I bet you don't uh, don't hate that being on the farm. What do you do, fifth gen? You know, I always wondered why that concrete looked that way. I'm terrible about clicking the cast and receive shadow. This tractor's got uh, quite a few hours on it. Once we get done unloading this, we'll unhook it and see how many hours it has on it. I think this might become our loader tractor, though. I uh, use it for a lot, really, to be honest. Bender, how is the bales that you wrap working for you? Somebody was saying earlier they usually uh, kind of move around. Do you have that problem or not? I think we'll use this tractor to go down and get the bales out of the field. Eh, we'll leave it hooked up. We'll use the... Uh oh, I was going to unhook the mixer quick. So this tractor has almost 50 hours on it. That's she's getting to be quite old. But like I said, I bought this one used. Okay, we got it all hooked back up. And that's what you have in real life, fifth gen. Nice little, it's a nice little herd. Nice little operation. Yeah, we used the big white to go down and get the. Uh, Bales. Let's get the bale trailer out of the weeds over here. So I will show you this too. I did end up doing a little landscaping. That's also why I had her slowed down to 0.5. I, I made myself another driveway, which we're probably going to need for auto drive when we get to be in a big operation, which is coming. Uh, this truck, this tractor keeps doing that. Oh, guess we ain't using this. I need to fix this. I need to just do away with the top. So I'm going to guess anything trailer low, maybe? It hooks to that. I wish it didn't have that on the back of it. 
I wanted to put that tractor on the blower and it kept hooking the blower up there. So I need to fix that. What's up, country fisher? Pleasant. Pleasant and chat. How's things? Things pretty good. How are you? Yep. Just about right for me and my son. Generally works well for me, except on flat ground. Had a couple of instances I had to wrestle the bales for super strength and then settle them down. So it's like somebody wrestling like a, a wild alligator or something, eh? There, Rev. Where are we going to put this baler? I don't want it to sit outside in case it rains. We'll pull it in the main shop here. We'll back it in the main shop here. You know, I thought that that planter moves, but I think that disc moves because I keep straightening that thing up and then it just somehow it keeps getting turned to the side like that. I forget, was there anything on the used market today that we needed to buy? Um, unhook yourself, please. Doesn't want to be unhooked. There we go. There we go. It's a nice D21. It is a nice D21. I keep thinking about putting the fats on it, the bigger, wider tires. But it's kind of a row crop tractor, too. Um, Jeremiah, I'm not sure. Maybe. Oop, we're not paying attention again. Thrash this tail around. <laughs> yes, we need to get this manure out of here. Our calves have grown up. They're now bulls, which we're going to need. We're going to need room for steers basically hey Bruce how are you how are you doing buddy glad you stopped by I kind of poked in your stream earlier but I didn't text I was kind of filling water tanks and I didn't have I had gloves on okay let's head on down to the field I'll show you this new driveway I made Yeah, I kind of, I kind of wish I would have bought that. Thinking about it now, let's check out the price on that. I don't even know where the bale wrappers are. Where's, the, what's the bale wrappers under? Probably under bale wrappers. Yeah, I could have went with something like this for thirty thousand. It'd have been cheaper than the. I should have done that. I have all this room out here. I could have put them bales right out here in the weeds. That gummin. I wish I would have done that now. Yeah, I forget what map you were playing on a different map today. I forget what map you were playing on today, Bruce. Yeah, I did, uh, Sim Station. If we look at um, the these bowls here, the base food, this 100 liters is actual corn. Uh, I fed them. So if I would build another building and I would just feed them nothing but corn, then they would eat the corn. I don't know how to... I guess I could put the corn, do away with hay and make base food, corn, and... Like really, I think I only need two things, like TMR and then hay and corn. I only need two. So yeah, I put this driveway in earlier. That's why I had it at 0.5 speed sim station. Catch it calling me out on that, but... Yeah, I was putting this driveway in. I added those trees over there, kind of did the ditch a little bit, and then I knew I wanted another little driveway, so I put that one in. And yeah, we're going to use um, auto load because that's how I am. Yeah, the cow barn you made for our platform. For... Oh, yeah, Joe, you can do whatever you want with it, you know. If you want to pretend like, yeah, don't need the dairy anymore, and we want to 
put calves in there, that works fine too. It did? That's weird. wonder why people have that problem, Bruce. I think Big Frosty used to have that problem. He gave up on it. I hope you don't have that kind of problem for a long time. Split Mountain Ranch, that's right. You need to add cracked corn to your alma, save for the steers. Yeah, see, I don't have cracked corn. It's just regular corn. Hey, Bruce. Yep, I'm the exact same. .5. Yeah, I was landscaping and making a thumbnail and stuff. Mess. I wasn't really farming, and then I forgot. He caught me. He caught me, Rev. I, well, I usually run a ride at five. We're just running around out here grabbing. Hopefully, can we get them all in one trailer? Let's hope. Yeah, we got to make it to July because I want to get that weed off this stream. Where's the eight thousand? I get. I. I knew sooner or later someone would ask, but yeah, I got tired of it rocking so much. I tried to bail with the claws baler and it was um, just driving me nuts. So that's why I went with the white. I need I need to spend some time. And now that I have substance painter, I need to maybe just do the eight thousand. Like get it get it good maybe. But that's why I gave it up. Dairy dear, you didn't need. I know. I, I wish I have it. I I like that tractor. Change it. I know, Jake. You're. Is that what combined you're really after? Is the forty and the fifty? Mill. Oh! Wow, well, I'm not paying attention. I knew I needed to turn, I just turned too much. Alright, let's read this quick. I want to edit the mill from JMF to make it make CCM, then edit my feed so steers can take that for feed. Yeah. Fender, I missed my 8,000, but I'd have to, I gotta start over. I can't figure out what makes it rock. I don't know if it's simple IC stuff, I don't know what it is. this beauty this is too close though what does everybody run like 70 it's a little far away what do you run rev when you're in cab shifting gears boys Okay, I can't do that too long. I'm a, I'm a third person player. I don't I can't play first person. If you have any questions, let's say my DMs are open. I want to see the tractor do well. What's up the cab? Yeah, I wanna I'd love to make it like my first tractor on them if I could get it as far as the mod hub, but the cab's already fixed. Like I already well I did a lot. I shouldn't or Gamer God did a lot to it. Now oh, you got me looking at this. Oh, I took it out. Yeah, I took it out. Yeah, I got tired of it, so I <laughs> took it all the way out. Dairy dear. I do too. I want the. I mean, the version I have is so much better than the version I released. I feel bad when people download it on my itch because I'm like, man, it could be so much better. Okay, there's the bales. They're in there now. I did. I almost did an orgsy. I seen that earlier, Rev. That was hilarious. So I don't know if anybody's watched the FSG RGZ competition, but they're going to go head for head, half a map, see who can own. It's kind of like what we're doing, but just a little bit more competitive. They're going to see who can own half the map, and then it's like team-wise. There's Team RGZ and Team FSG, and it's cross-platform. Um, so, yeah, anybody can, I think anybody can join their farms. 
And, and uh, yeah, it's, it'd be kind of interesting. Let's see what that field. Did I spread some manure? Do I spread some manure? I could. Could spread some slurry. Just bought the combine. Pleasant shoey, lots of money. What do you mean, Justin? You bought the. Are you talking about the gleaner? Just bought the combine. I don't know what you mean, Justin. Uh, she's a beaut. Oh, you said it to. D oh, that's weird. Today on your, I was watching you plan. It looked like it was a little bit different. Team Sim versus Team Plasma. <laughs> oh, I don't know. <laughs> I'd rather just. I don't know. It's an interesting concept, to be honest with you. I mean, it's a great thing for both their channels, really, because, I mean, think about it. I mean, you're getting your people to, like, play together and stuff. And... Alright, let's get some manure. Oh, yeah, the cat combine is, ex is expensive. I want it so bad, but it's so stinking expensive. Let's use the other driveway again. Let's go out on the road. Oh, we can turn the flashers and stuff on. I mean, there's no traffic on this. I would love to add traffic to this road. Because it just feels like it needs traffic. Scheming. You're right, Jeremiah. Bunch of scheming. Uh, I'm not saying it. I don't know. Maybe it is. Dairy Deer. Affordable. Um... I guess I always had the gleaner so cheap. I just, uh, I mean, cause what the claws or the cats like two, two hundred thousand, right? Yeah, two ten. We're in the corn. Um, yeah, I'm not saying maybe it is. I mean, maybe it realistically is, but. There's that edge doing its thing again. That's okay. Let's set up a little GPS so we can get some nice slurry applied here. I don't know why this runs an offset. Let's just run a zero offset. Holy smokes, you guys are chatting so fast. Good thing I got GPS here. Okay, so Pleasant, does your main barn produce solid manure? I'm on the small farm, main barn, but get no manure from them. Are you putting straw in, Country Fisher? Yeah, if you're talking about the main dairy barn, all, all my barns should create manure. Um, you just have to add straw. Even if it could be like one third of the standard amount of trap. Yeah, that's what I want, Fender. Like. Uh, just a little bit of traffic. Not not a full amount, just a little bit of traffic. Hey Rob Hagner, how are you doing? Uh pickaxe, how are you tonight? Some station hey, pickaxe. You hold some manure today to the bathroom, Benny? Oh boy. Oh Benny. I still ain't seen the hiding or tail of Kyle lately. I don't know where the heck he's been. Yeah, from cell to Reese, but it looks like the back roads might. Oh, I seen he was working on an update. Um, I don't know if this is even updated. Like his first update. It might be. I'm not sure. What's up, Caleb? How are you tonight? Yeah, Donna probably does. She probably found him and 
been keeping him hidden. I don't know what he's been up to. Usually he messages me. I, I haven't really heard nothing from him. We're going to add a little bit more here on the end. Holy mackerel. We're burning through it, which is good. Maybe we won't put that on the end like that. Yeah, I know. It's like he got hooked on her and now he's gone. He gone forever. You'd come drive this for me, Bruce? Sometimes I need, yeah, a manure hauler, a feed mixer. Really should put the duels on her to do this job, but... Oh, I forgot. That's what I was going to... Oh, be your traffic. Oh, I got you. As long as you don't run me off the road, Bruce. Puppy love. <laughs> yeah, I forgot I was going to make my um, thumbnail say realistic farm. You want me to teach you to be doing realistic farming? I guess you could haul without duels on, but... And we're hauling on hay ground, which would be a little bit more firm. Yeah, I seen you were hauling line back to a like a beef farm today. There, uh, pickaxe. He's a yeah pickaxe. He does he does a little bit of YouTube video and stuff, and he he's a truck driver and he drives dump truck real life. Yeah, Bruce probably would. I seen he drives some fairly quick uh, vehicles. He probably would slide right into me like that S10. Yeah, ground shouldn't be super soft. You're right, Ref. And this thing's got 200 horses, supposedly, so we should be pretty good horsepower-wise. Yeah, I don't know what we're going to do over here in this grass field. I could convert it back to the pasture that it was, I guess. Also, I don't know why my cows... I thought I had grazing on. I don't know why they don't eat the grass. Doesn't the grass usually go down? Or am I thinking of something? Maybe I'm wrong. You remember, don't you, Benny? Yeah, Bruce, I seen you. You get on some of them wild vehicles and you're going super fast. What do you guys think I should do with this? Should I hold off on this and make it like... I was even thinking about if we future put like a bin... Bin site there or something. I don't know. Or should I convert it back to pasture? I mean, we are a dairy farm. It would be fitting if it was... Kind of pasture, I guess. Oh, the pasture has to be set up for grazing? Oh, okay, I don't... I don't know how the grazing mod works, I guess. To be honest with you, Scooter. <laughs> don't use any... That's weird. You guys don't use any duels. But you, I don't think your roadways are like what our roadways are like. Oh, we gotta get that hay tatter out of here, too. That's not gonna be in our way. Um, duels pretty much, Rev, is kind of like, you don't always need duels. It just kind of helps with, it's not even compaction really. Sometimes it's just a matter of helping you with, um, just traction and just, sometimes you just need a little extra traction. Something like this would be more for weight distribution, so the tank's heavy. It'd be nice to have an extra set of tires on the back just to help hold the weight and help stabilize things. Yeah, Bruce coming in, he'd be zoom right on by. I'd be probably run off the road and then ditch. About like, if anybody remember when we were playing in Canada, I forget what that map was, we played in Canada. Ryan come driving by in the semi, I can see why it runs an offset now. Ryan comes sliding by in the semi, hit me in the swather I was driving, and then he passed me, and then he <laughs> ended up in the ditch. Oh, so funny. That was a pretty fun, that was a pretty fun server. We did the uh, 
Canadian Ag thing? Or no. Yeah, it was it Canadian Ag? Oh, uh, Ryan and I, we had a little baler wagon, a little uh, hay rack from Brewster Mods. And I pulled up on the back of the semi, then he strapped me down, and we went flying. I don't know why the physics did that, but oh my gosh, we were sky high. Yeah, I assumed that, Rev. I assumed all your roadways and stuff were pretty small gate holes. On your left? Yeah, Bruce. It wasn't on Edgewater. It was on, like... Uh, I think it began with a C or something. I can't remember what it was. It had, like, a big mountain in the background. You remember what it was, Ryan? I don't remember what that map was called. If you, if you type it, I would remember, but... It was custom... Well, no. We all... There was, like, four of us that had farms, and then we had, like, one... So Canadian Ag was like a, yeah, like a custom outfit, and we could work there. Basically, any one of us could work there, and then we basically made the money off of the contracts we did. It's Chilliwack, yeah, that's what it was, Chilliwack. Yeah, Chilliwack was fun. It, it wasn't a, it wasn't a bad. Ma I don't even remember who made that map. But it wasn't a bad map, but it wasn't a like a super. I don't want to say not super detailed. It was just, it was laid out a little differently. But we had fun, man. That was that was a good fun map. I remember we went down and helped one of the guys mow hay, and I literally took the seven thousand Alice and strapped it on the top of my pickup so I could get there faster. Cause it was like I think that's a four X map. <laughs> Um, what's our, we're still driving, what's our nitrogen, we're definitely adding nitrogen, I guess, but yeah, I don't know, has anybody else experienced, how long does it take for the alfalfa to grow, like, it's growing, but man, I would have thought by June, I would have had my first cutting off of it. We might haul about one more load, and then, uh feed the cows again because we're gonna have to feed the cows again and then move into oh uh, we gotta get to gotta get to July so we might just back us up a little tick leave out there I'm sure the cows are hungry look at that they're eating oh, it's 10 30 I've been scared to grow half off yet. Yeah, I know the alfalfa has not worked for some people. I was hoping it would work fine. I'd say let's mix another batch of feed. I'll get us to 30,000. And then we will... Oh, wonder why... What are these bales not going for? Must not have been inside the zone. Worst thing is when I come around with a skid loader, I think it's gonna drop them in. I have to go wide. So yeah, I need to figure out what my next mixer is gonna be. I think it's probably gonna be the Supreme. I don't know what else mixer is out there that's any good. Like the Supreme 1200 or something. I seen uh, Fender was using a big one. I forget who his hit was. Yeah, it's hard to beat grass. It's just. And the other thing with the alfalfa, I'd like to do is shorten it up when it's ready. It's too tall. You would you wouldn't have your alfalfa that tall in real life. All right, let's just. Uh, yeah, let's just put some haylage in. We'll have hay and haylage. 
all hay, I guess. I mean, it's coming out of silage. Yeah, <laughs> I'm doing living paycheck to paycheck, Rev. Yeah. Hey, Ken Strader. I don't know how I was here last. Stalber. Maybe that's how you say it. How are we doing tonight? I don't know if I said hi to you. I didn't realize you were in here. Clover is cool. It drops a grass swath when harvested. Kind of a two. Anderson group. Yeah, where's that? Where's that out of though? Fender, is that on the mod hub? A700 is something I believe. What kind of shenanigans? Well, we're just... We're doing all the shenanigans. Trying to stay out of driving into the ponds. We're trying to keep the cows fed. We're looking to get the Amish hired to build the next cow barn. I don't even know how we're milking cows in here. We have no milking parlor. We got this nice big window though. I keep thinking about redoing this. <laughs> I don't know why. Like lower the door. Make it like a sliding door. Redo the windows. Or I could essentially just drop it. I don't know. I don't know what to do with it. It's on the mod hub. Okay, I need to check. I need a good bigger mixer. You're retiring? Yeah, you can't retire. Everybody loves legacy buildings. Okay, we're at 33, so that should get us through the evening. I got 7,000, so that should be good there. Yeah, I guess so. You're right, Benny. I guess I'm bringing them in, putting their little heads in here. I think about redoing this too, put like a concrete feed bunk like my other barn has in it. Put like a concrete bunk in it, like this. Because ideally, I would just make this my steer barn here. And then put my heifers here. Over here. I guess I need to build a calf barn. It's really what I need. Oh, when I got ideas. The EU signals? Oh, on the Anderson thing? Yeah, Legacy has... <laughs> uh, okay, yeah, it's 10 o'clock, you know, we already milked two times, fed twice. We're going to make $10 million tonight and buy the map so I can beat Sim Station at his own game. What is it going to be? June 3, so we still got to go through one more day. Hey, Luke. Glad you did talk, though. Glad you're here watching, anyways. I don't know how that could be sometimes. Today I was just kind of had Sims running another thirty-five thousand seven. Look at that, we're up to six hundred two thousand dollars. Eight eight. Oh yeah, I know. We slept in just a little bit. Hopefully the cows are okay. Let's go out here and check Bessie. How are you today? She's twenty-five months. Oh no, they're eating, they're eating away on that grass. How you doing there, lady? Oh, we got a different paddock over here. Hello, hello. Hmm. I don't know how they're supposed to get from one to the other, but... Sure. Also don't know why I didn't put straw. Oh shoot. He's bloated. You alright there, lady? Ain't looking good. She needs some straw. Let's get some straw into these cows. But if Legacy doesn't make buildings, how will Scooter make productions out of them? You're more of a 280. <laughs> yeah, you're right, Fender. Yeah. I already went. I already got up, milked, and then I went back, took a little nap, got up at 8. That's what happened. Now look up at that top left, oh, right hand corner there. 602. I think I think what's gonna happen here, and I I don't know if I should say it on stream, but I think I think this is where we're gonna go. We're gonna buy this big devil. You know, I'm watching Sim. He's making a mistake. He's buying all these little fields. He's driving them up. Just go after the big boy. 
square this puppy. Let's go take a gander at that piece of property real quick. Let's let's just take a little peek at it. Is that what we should be doing, you guys think? Oh yeah, definitely. Square this corner up a little nicer. I don't know what the heck is. I guess we got some ditches, that's fine. Work this up nice, maybe split this in two fields, maybe? Maybe two or three fields? Get a tiling crew in here, get rid of those waterways, because I'm not a waterway kind of person, you know? What's this? How bad is this? Oh, this is nothing but a little tree, a little fence line. Maybe put us a driveway in, like right here. Huh? I think I think that's the play. What do you guys think? Yeah, I know, I Benny. I'm hoping I don't, you know, shoot myself. We gotta build that cow barn first. That's where the money's gonna be coming from. Oh, there's supposed to be a house there or something. Okay, we gotta turn off speed, otherwise I'm already running. I wonder if I turn this to one, will it be a little bit? S oh, two's. That's a little bit better than this run, isn't it? That's yeah, about the same. I have the schemes for what I want to do with the corner either. For bins? Yeah, I don't know. Okay, what are we doing? You guys got me distracted. Um, is our haylage all converted? Nope, still converting. So I doubled the hay, uh, how fast it makes silage because... Or no, I, did I double it? I don't remember what I... Or no, I made him, maybe it had more. I think he had it set to like 24 cycles an hour and I changed it to 60 cycles an hour. So every minute it's actually converting stuff. I think that's what I did. I'm pretty sure that's what I did. All right, let's get out here and what do we got? We got uh, we got a lot of haylage. Let's just grab 45% of our haylage. I know we should be mixing a little bit of both. Probably really wouldn't be using dry hay for the cows, but. I don't have it set up really realistic. Yeah, Luke, it is. It's snowing. Or it was. I can't really tell now. It's dark out. Oop, that's not what I meant to do. I meant to turn on that PTO. We be needing that PTO on. Thirty-four, forty-two, forty-five. Forty-five, there we go. All right, let's pull up. We'll grab ourselves this single solo bale right over here. We'll throw him in. Oh, hey. Wish I knew more, like, when you walked in here, how much food. They got 2,900 liters. I know I need, like, five, 4,000 or something a day. Uh, what do they need? 4,500 liters. So I'd switch them to corn, but I don't have any corn. I sold it all, so they're on a strict hay diet. Hey, Bog Ball, Ball Family Farms. Practical Plays, how are you guys doing tonight? Thanks for stopping in. I don't generally say stuff like this, but uh, if you guys don't mind hitting that thumbs up button. Helps me out. And if you haven't, maybe subscribe to the channel. We're getting pretty close to 1,800. Which is pretty impressive, to be honest with you. Alright, let's dump that bale in there, like so. I've gotten better about this, instead of just super strengthening it. And I still haven't looked into why... Why the feed bin won't dump into that. I'm, I'm guessing it's the mixer, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I said hi to you, sick Bert, but how are you doing? Glad to have you in. The Beast, how are you this evening? I was gonna, I gotta put straw into the cows, that's what I was gonna do. 
I need some new bedding. Should I make this like a little heifer barn? I don't know what to do with this thing. I just don't know what to do with it. And I guess I'm saying I could make it into a heifer barn now, but I'm saying like add some details to the inside or no? I don't know. Hopefully though, I'm hoping next week I can get the shop sent out to Giants. So if you guys have been following along, you know I've been building my older traditional shop. Um, so I'm hoping I pretty much got it all down. I just got to make a, in the mod desk, I got to make a uh, description for it. We need more feed, 16,000. So yeah, we might as well just hit it for another one. Pleasant View Merch. What do you guys think of the new logo? I should have put a poll. Let me put a poll up here quick. I, I want to ask what everybody thinks. So Sim Station made me that new... Um, logo. How do, What should I ask? How does the new logo look? Good. There we go. I started a poll. Yeah, testing list. So, yeah, I don't know, Jay Graham. I don't know. I don't know anything about merch. Uh, it would be interesting, but I don't know. What would you be looking at? Hats or something? I don't know. Shirts? I don't know that I'm to that point yet. Let's put some haylage in the mixer. It's expensive to make. Yeah, I'm sure it is. I wonder if it would be less expensive, Sims, if like if you and I both made merch at the same time, like, would that make it less expensive? Like, obviously, it would be different brands, but, like... And, like, what would be the cheapest? Like, shirts? Would shirts be the cheapest? I'm not sure. Which means it's expensive to buy. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, you wouldn't want to buy a shirt that's more than, what, like, 20 bucks or... 20 something. I mean, nobody's wanting a Pleasant View Farm shirt for, you know, 40 bucks. Have you looked into it before? Oh, I parked on the wrong side. How expensive is it going to be to make your cooking book that you're going to be making soon? God, I want to get in that wheat harvest so bad. I think we're just gonna kind of just skip through today, even though I'd like to haul some slurry down there. What are these steers looking like? Yeah, they're good. It's 300 bucks for 12 hats, so that's like 20 some bucks for a hat. <laughs> yeah. I got you. I get you. Shoot. I bet people would buy that stuff left and right. Sim Station. Who wouldn't want a Sim Station merchandise? Your channel is growed. So I just remember, I think it was last year, right? February? You were shooting for like 2,000? Oh, look at you. are like 7,000, I think, or something, aren't you? I don't know if Legacy's still in here, but... You think I got enough room for your pantry? Got that nice grass... Uh, old pasture over there. 7,000? I guess I thought you were over 7,000. What keeps you motivated to continue to play through one save game? I ask because I'm always bouncing through different games because I get bored and don't get anywhere on the save game. 
have you ever like set like goals up for yourself there at practical plays like like this one is own the map like maybe that's something that would keep you intrigued like personally I'm trying to beat Sim Station because he thinks he can own the map before me but I mean let's be honest the dairy is where it's at triple that area oh I think it would fit I don't know what I would do with it but it would probably crash my game I was big. I was the big uh, pantry last night. No need to. I guess I could buy the uh, um, field right here. I, it would probably fit over here, wouldn't you think, Legacy? The pantry? It probably would. Alright, do we have enough feed yet? How much feed do we got? Holy cats, we only got 27,000. We, we need a bigger mixer already. Let's pull out of the corn sides. We don't want to get rotten. We'll pull ourselves. It's only 86,400 square feet. That's not big, no. She's tiny. I don't know how I really want to make it. Like, I know they have on the mod hub like a TMR like a um, oh what is it like you put your things in and it makes TMR for you to me that isn't totally realistic but yeah it's just gonna get too monotonous I don't know Not big till you're ten thousand. Uh, yeah. I probably would need a bigger dairy setup if I'm going to uh, be needing a pantry. That's for sure. Yeah, I want to get. A, I don't know that I want to go to bunks. I'm just gonna run a bunch of silos. There we go. Hopefully, we can get into July one. Chat would get ignored the entire stream. My <laughs> building more. Oh, it's a process. It's a thing. I wish I had another screen rather than like I just watch off my phone. That's how I watch chat. Um, and I just, I've said this before. I just play in my living room. So it the phone sits on the armrest of my lazy boy. And I play on my TV. And that's how I mod and do everything. So it likes to move around. It's kind of hard to stare at, but that's what she said. Yeah, that's what she said. Boom, roasted. Some people will get it. I'm guessing Scooter will get it. William Butlicker. That's such a good show. Okay. 39,000. It's 9 o'clock in the morning. This wheat's coming off tomorrow, no doubt. Oh, so I side-dressed the corn. I rented a, uh, which is stupid. I should have just used my fertilizer spreader, but I rented a 28 applicator and I side-dressed all my corn. This is still growing. 70, Benny. 70 inch. You play in the captain's chair in my RV? Yeah, I wish I had more monitors. Well, yeah, there you go, Eric. You know. How dare you? My family built this country. Yes, Michael, I like the sound of your voice. Michael, don't do it. It's a million dollar sale. Such a good show. Let's go bed them cows down. I 
I know, I need more mod. I need... I just don't know that I can get out of where I play at now. I bought liquor, our prices have never been lower. Some of you got it, some of you got it. I like it. Alright, alright. Do I need a complex? I don't know what I need. Do I need... Like, I want to look real quick. Let me take a gander. What did you send? Where did you send? Oh, okay. I'm assuming you guys said you can hear me, right? Holy guacamole. That's a lot of silos. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and a baby silo. And I'm guessing what? There's like a barn on the back side there, Country Fisher, that um, all feeds to the same place? Or like has a conveyor or something, I'm guessing? Uh, I'm just waiting for Sim to get us sucked up to go to... Um, what's his name? Kip Sigler. I would so build Kip Sigler's farm. I would build that in a heartbeat right now. Are we skipping to... What do you guys... What do you think? Should we be... We gotta check this poll. I didn't check the poll when I backed out. Good. Everybody likes it. It's okay. I like the old one. There we go. Seems like most everybody likes it. I like the baby harvester on the end. Oh, so the freestyle's on the back side. So, Red, there's this little one. Uh, actually, I don't know what they're in. I think they're in Silas. Yeah, there's this one. I just don't like the room. I don't need the little room on the end. Like, the silos I see, they all... Some run to a room. They have conveyors that run to rooms, but... I mean, some of the ones I've seen, they sit all next to each other, and they literally sit on a concrete pad. There's a room in between, like... It would be more like this. There'd be a room for three silos. Um, something like that. That's how I've seen them in real life. What do you... <laughs> Get out of here, Brad. How are you doing, Brad? Aren't you supposed to be working? You can't come in the YouTube and then have your name <laughs> as your actual name. Ryan's in here somewhere. Just bought about 20 cows. Yeah, I know he does. Um, Sim Station. I think I might just build my own. I want some different size. Well, I know he's got different size ones too. Need to play with them at some point. It's such a job deciding on which bin I like to even. Which bin I like to even. What are we talking about, Rev? Which bin I like to even. Okay, we put two bales in there. That should be good. All right, let's um, let's put a bale into the steers, I guess, or we could put them last two bales in for the steers. Will they just keep creating manure? Oh boy, I didn't think about that. Yeah, let's see how big we can get that manure pile. You know. Oh, I got gotcha. you. Yeah, I don't. I don't necessarily think the bin that I have fits this style of farm. Like, it's too new. I need to take JCLs and finish making them into productions. I just don't know why I haven't done that yet. I assume I can fit another bale in there, right? No, I can't. We'll put this bale for the cows then, then we'll be all out of straw. Yeah, I don't want to break my one tying on my gear loader, so let's back up. Pick it up at least with two. Don't go in the bale storage, I don't want it to go in the bale storage. Run this to the cows. 
I feel like we're just rolling through the time, but I just like the, oh, I don't know where I'm going. Fling in the bales. Okay. Because you would think, right? You would think the bale trigger would be inside of the pen. You wouldn't put it out front of the pen. But that's okay. That's okay. We're getting her. There we go. Okay. We ready to get this gleaner out? I'm ready to get into some wheat harvest. Because then we get the wheat off. Then we can start getting this cow shed placed down. Okay. We got all our equipment shut off. These cows got... 39,000 liters, so we should be good, right? Yep. We need to haul more manure, but no one's here to haul manure for us. The lawn is in terrible shape. Oh boy, it's in bad shape. We're gonna have to get the bush hog up here, it's so bad. I don't even think the lawnmower will get through it. Okay, it's, it's only 8 o'clock. It's early. We're gonna get up for the second time today at 8 o'clock. Got up, did the early morning milking. All right. $39,000 worth of milk. Look at that up there in the right hand corner. We're up to $627,000. Woo. And we're only milking 60 cows. Imagine when we're milking 300. Year three, we buy the whole map. In two nights. Okay, hopefully that wheat's... Oh yeah, there we go. Wheat's ready to go. But it's only 8 o'clock in the morning, so we're gonna... Let's run speed a little bit faster. Let's get to... Ten... Yeah, 10 will be fine. I want to get to about noon. And that should be good. You gotta be cheating. <laughs> I'm not cheating. Uh, all I'm using is enhanced animals. That's all. I didn't alter any type of milk. How much milk they're making or anything. The only thing I altered was how much manure they're making. Because. Uh, see their slurry is not going up that fast. Because man they. Gosh they make so much slurry. You gonna need me to pump them numbers up? Well, I don't, <laughs> I don't have a mega operation. 300 is gonna be a lot. I I make I mini farm pretty much everything. Like buying a 12 row planter out of the gate, that is wild for me. But I knew farming this whole map, I'm not gonna get by with an eight row or a six row. So I end up buying the 12 row right out of the gate. How big are our other cows? Our heifers there. They're nine months, so they're just... I forget when you mount... Or no, you don't breed them until almost year two, right? Yeah. Oh, look at this. We got calves. Oh, boy. So we got to get them out of there. Because they will suck down the... Oh, man. We're going to have to... Should we be building a calf barn? This will hold 30. But where do we put it? Down here? Do we put it inside of the cow pen? Yeah, like I said, we're going to put the dairy barn over here and probably the silos. Well, yeah, we're getting calves on top of stuff. <laughs> I don't know, Rev. Hey, Dan, how are you? Out of curiosity, I thought of doing a corn plus each other. Do you want me to do that? Yeah, I'm probably not going to mess with the gleaner much, Jake, to be honest with you. I could help you with the header thing, but... I uh, like making it all one mod. That's pretty simple. Or making it change. Where do we put this? Do we put this down here like... This? That doesn't seem... Wait a tick. Don't I have the one that changes all the colors? I have the mod hub one on here. But 
Oh, e ew. Oh well, kind of matches, I guess. I'll have to switch that out at some point. Maybe I won't place it down. What do you guys think, Chip? Hmm. I'm not sure where to place our calf barn. Redo the fence. Uh, no, that wouldn't be a good spot. It'd be kind of slick if it was on the back of here like this, though. Hmm. Where the... I'm lost. Ideas. Ew, I know. Yuck. And Fender is like, yeah, that's what I could use. Poor guy. Okay, we got calves. We gotta move. Actually, I don't think this building will hold anymore, will it? Or like, it'll only hold 50 animals. How are you though, Dan? I think you're doing well. He chatted with you in a while. It holds 40, and I got 25, so I ain't got enough room. Um, uh, we need a bale hay. Wait, we gotta slow down. We gotta start mowing hay. All right, let's let's not get in too big a hurry. We can mow hay this morning. Dude, we got calves. We got heifers. Oh boy. This operation's taking off. What did I say? I don't know what I said about my own mod. Ew. How I said ew about my own mod. Yeah, because Giants made me... That's why Legacy doesn't want to... Or no. Maybe it's TPF. Somebody said they don't want to put them on the mod. It might have been TPF. Because you, gotta, you can't have all the color selections. Yeah, I'm doing real good, Dan. Uh, you still been playing the game much or no? So we'll get the cows fed in the morning. Hopefully, let's check that alfalfa. Hopefully that alfalfa is ready to go. We need bales. We ain't got time for your shenanigans. Oh yeah, she's ready. The next one of you that says shenanigans. I got you, Jake. Ew. Yeah, what, D21 on the mower? Yeah. What are we going to do with our wheat? Probably just sell our wheat direct. Which will work out sweet because I put in auto drive. Put it where the chopper boxes are. See, thanks, Rev. At least somebody said something. Nobody else said anything. Put it over here. Yeah, I just don't know if I'm gonna what I'm gonna do with it. If I'm gonna make this pasture again, like I could just drop the building back into this, and this would all become pasture again. I could get rid of this bin. I could get rid of this bin. Hear me out. Hear me out, fellas. What if I got rid of that bin? And then put the calf barn. I could put two calf barns here. Like one here. And then put one like here. Which would give us like 60 head for calves. Because think, we're going to have a lot of calves. Nice buildings. Yeah, Dan. You seen the shop? Have you seen the shop? Um, okay, we got to get this big rig. Unhooked. Let's get the D21 hooked. Or, uh, warming up. This is going to be on probably wagon duty. The white is. Running the town. We might try to draw a course play thing up for the guy mowing hay. We're just going to park that there for now. Okay, there we go. Okay, you do that, Rev. I, I really appreciate it. Everybody else just sits here and says, nothing. Nada. Is Enhanced Animals on PS4? Sadly, Ethan, no. It's not. Yeah, it's pretty much, Dan, uh, air free, test runner free. I just need to write up the mod 
uh, description for it, which I'm terrible at because I don't really know what to write. Like it's a shed, or it's a shop. I don't know what else. I don't know what else to write. Yeah, I just kind of feel it out, Rev. I've seen a lot of operations, so I kind of just think about what makes more sense. Or oh, a corn's really taking off, ain't it? Look at that corn popping up in rows. Okay, I I drew well. Uh, one time I drew a course play thing in. Let's see if I can remember how to do that. I don't even remember how to start it. Okay, I think you go here. I got a clear. Okay, then I go back. Great job. Field work. Nope. No. I'm trying to think of where the draw thing was. Was it here? No. Um, uh, that's good. Hey, simulation farms. Size, name, utility, and price. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what you mean, Ken. Size, name, utility. Oh, for the description. Yeah, I always like to put a little thing, thing in there. Did I do this? Nah, that's not what I want. Um, there we go. Draw custom fields. There it is. So from there. Wait, how do I draw the custom fields? Oh yeah, there we go. That's going to be terrible, ain't it? Or we'll recognize it, you think? Wait a minute. I tell you what. Would it be easier if I just had it like... How do I delete these? Nope. Draw. What if I just did this? Hmm. Okay. Yes. Okay, so now I go... Right, there we go. Clockwise, yes. Let's go a little bit bigger. Because it did seem like I was... Eh, well, let's not. Um, Magnum, how you doing, buddy? It's been a while since I've seen you. Rob, how much power? Sort by price. I think there's a mod like the super shop sort of fall order so order me okay um we're gonna do i just want him to go around and around and around let's see how that goes i think if we keep just adding this up then it just figures it out for you i want this to be zero i want him to go this way Please don't break my game. What the heck? Oh, multiple tools? No, we don't have four multiple tools. We have one. We don't have a big sim station farm where he was. Let's go a few more. I don't know if it. So I wanted this to go around and around. Okay, that looks good. Looks good, looks good. There we go, we're gonna let him go. Doing good, I haven't seen any of your live streams up. Huh. Usually they're up. Oh, yeah, I post them in 
Fairview's Discord. Where are you going, guy? Where are you going? Hopefully he doesn't start cutting my wheat. We got Dale. There he is. Anybody who's been following along in Discord, there's Dale. He's doing it. He's out there getting a suntan on the D21. Oh boy, he's going to get her done. All right. Good stuff. Um, where's the white? Let's get the white hooked up to the wagons. We got to get things hooked. Yeah, remember Dale? Um, who's got Jason? You got Jason, don't you, Fender? Yeah, you got Jason. Sim's got, he's got Bobby, and he's got Bill. Bobby and Bill, I think. And I got Dale. Yeah, about time, Dale. What the heck you been up to? All right, Magnum. You have a good one. Thanks for stopping by, though. Kyle's got Donna. <laughs> You're right. Kyle's got Donna. Yep. Dale's got the suns out, guns out, you know. Does this have a cord? Yep, it's got a cord. There we go. We're all hooked up. All right, let's get these, get these spun around out here. I'm not going to have enough room there. We might as well just go down to the... So we're we're making so much money, uh, Sim Station on milking. We're just gonna sell our grain direct because we don't really care. Here's how I'm gonna trying to think of how to set up auto drive is what I'm trying to think how to do this. You got Jeff working? Holy smokes! Me too. I'll try to stop by again next stream. See you later, Mr. Alice, man. Alright, let's, uh... So I'm thinking if I bring it down, then he hits that driveway down here. Right? And then he can pull in that driveway, drive around the thing, and he'll pop back at the end row. I'll have it set for that field. And should be good, I would think. Life should be good. Okay. I have to get up here and make a different course. Dinner and tone. All right, slow down. I'm trying to read. Don't read chat and set auto drive. The dinner in town accepts flyers on the bulletin board. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I heard Cliff. Yeah, maybe Cliff needs to. Rev, he, he does it all himself, I think, Benny. I don't think he hires anybody. I could be wrong. Do I want this to be a two-way course? Why do I want this set up? I never did get that tether out of there. See that? All right, let's just go by. Gonna have to jack it back around, but we'll get it. We'll get it. All right, let's turn the rack around. Yeah, Rev wants to do it himself. He, you know, he he asked some people. Hey, I got this nice four-row planner. Couldn't get nobody. I was like, eh, I'm busy. I got that thing. So we're not still recording. Okay, so I'm thinking we're going to do a two-way back county road. So to do a two-way, you hit shift. This is the secondary road. And then you hit right mouse. Now this will be a brown um, road, or however you want to say, auto drive. And this is like your secondary roads. So they'll never drive on a secondary road unless they're prompted to go to like something that's on that road but you can connect it with there yeah I think that's connecting yeah you can connect it with green because it doesn't matter I was hoping to keep him off the grass field but 
so it'll be easy. So yeah, I can use this kind of for all kinds of stuff actually. Yeah, that's gonna work slick. Now I'm not gonna be able to like bring anything down as wide like a combine or planner or anything like that, but it'll definitely get us a more of a route this way, you know. Look how that's working out. He's mowing right up to there. I maybe could have drawed it out. Maybe it would have been fine. I don't know. I've never really drawn one out. I drew one out on Ohio Richlands. That's been about it. So we're going to bring him up. And we're just going to go right to our other points. And we'll come back and make a point for this field. So what we're going to do is we're going to have this guy just sit here on the end. Haul in the wagon to the town and I'm going to run the combined. It's getting to be about 10 o'clock uh, in the morning. So we got a little bit of time yet. Wheat still got a little bit of moisture. Picked up a little, little bit of dew over the night. So we'll come around this ledge here, right? And then we'll come up. I've already got points here. Right, so this is a one-way street. So I made these go... So now I can click um, stop. So those are jackknife in our wagons. That's okay. So for this to go, it has to go this way. I think you can make them yellow if you like. Uh, how do you do that again? I think if you hold shift. No. Maybe you can't make them. Come on. Yeah, it won't let me make them, but I don't think it matters. Maybe I should edit the 71 John Deere planner down to a two. <laughs> See what happens. Hire people. We had a single row for the horses revved. There you go. Okay, so that's going that way. Right, that's going that way. So this one's going this way. Oh yeah, so this would could also go. This is a two-way, so it could go like this. No. I don't want to mess that up yet. I want him to go to town. And that's going to be a good way for him to go to town. He'll hit that road, then go to town. I'm not going to add anything in yet. We're going to see how it works out first. We'll hop this guy back and spin him around. Park him on the ends. Then we're gonna go have to, we gotta get the header out. Hooked up. Hey, see you later, Eric. Thanks for coming in. Where do we want this guy to be? About in the middle, I think. All right, right about here. And then we're just going to call this. I usually like to stay close to what the fields were. So like this is field 40. I guess we could call it field 40. That's kind of how I do my. We're going to call it field 40. Yeah, that's good. So we're going to have him go to field 40. No. He drops at the grain cell point. I think it's how this works. Then he... Oh, wait. I think it's field 40. And then drop at the grain cell point. Wheats. Nope. Maybe I'm wrong. Stop. There we go. Now we got her. Alright. We're ready. To, we're ready to combine. We got that guy out there jackknifing it. He's okay. He's fine. Actually, let's... You know what? You can just... Take a break for now. Till we're ready to go. Let's get the gleaner out, boys. Uh, man, we got stuff in here. We can maybe sneak the WD in there, huh? Ah, right, let's get this gem out. Yeah, the old lady might be driving the night, Benny. 
Hopefully that's not too loud. Hopefully I didn't like... This thing is pretty loud, isn't it? I hope, hopefully my sound's okay for the night. I never really asked. I never really change anything, so. Oh boy, three miles an hour. I make her back there by the time the wheat's ready. So I'm trying to come in a little bit of an angle so we can swing it away from there. Hope oh, need to come back a little bit more. There we go. What are we running? A 25 foot header? Oh yeah, I forgot. They're somehow attached. Shoot. I think the header trailer like picked this up somehow or something. Yeah. Dad gum. How am I gonna... We'll just drag it outside. Oh, I know what we're gonna have to do. We'll just reset the corn head. Is what we're gonna have to do. And it'll reset it off of the... There we go. That worked. Just banging on the side of the barn. We're just gonna pull this right out to the field. I'll back up so it's not so loud. Come on, baby. Doesn't really sit real nice on the header trailer, but... Hey, see you later, Luke. Thanks for stopping by. Hopefully you have a good evening. How's everybody doing? They got their popcorn out, ready to see some corn or some wheat harvest. Hmm, where do we want to put this on? Let's just put this on right here. That'd be a good spot right here. There we go. That tractor actually has some really good sound to it. Well, how there, Golden Gaming? How are you? It's going to be a little tight to get up in there, but we're going to do her. Right through the side of the barn, that's fine. We got, uh... I don't know how to change the hour. Like, if I want to see the hours, how do I... I don't know how I change that. Hey there, guy. Look at this guy. More like wheat thins. Why are you putting so much emphasis on the H? I'm not. Wheat thins. What? That's okay, Jake. We're just playing. You know too much about the gleaners. Did you get yourself a custom logo? Cool whip. Uh, there, row crop. Sorry, I got distracted. I think I gotta hook these things up yet. There we go. Okay, let's turn the straw chopper off because we don't want to do that. We want to keep our straw. Let's turn the combine on. I'm not sure if this is going to do... I think I have the combine experience thing in here. Yeah, we're going to turn that off. Okay. Flying forces, how are you? Let's find that um, combine thing. I forget which tab that's in. Right here. Off all. Yeah, let's turn it all off. Oh, we're getting some logos. Add any new mo any new mods out pleasant. Ah, uh, we're working on them. We're working on them. What happened? Why did my header shut off? The shop's probably going to be the next one out. 
Let's get a little GPS lined up here. There we go. Okay, six is a little aggressive. Okay, we're gonna cut in. Back up here, we're gonna cut over. Hey, see you later, Eller. Have a good one. Thanks for coming in. So we're going to go with this as our straight edge. How's our wheat doing? Pretty good? Yeah, not bad. Not great, but not bad. Does anyone have horses on there? <laughs> That'd be really farm bros. That'd be really starting small. And man, you gotta, you know, map like this, you gotta get so big, so. I'd take you a while. That would take a while with some horses, that's for sure. But now we can get some straw for our cattle. Somehow, I don't know if like Legacy's still in here. I'd like to maybe add sawdust for the freestyle barn. That's kind of more what you would be bedding with with the freestyle barns. You want to put horses on it, Red? You need to be going more the other way. You need to be getting yourself like a bigger tractor and stuff. What I just curious, what have you what have you invested your money in on your own the map breath? I need to fix this corner a little bit. It's a little wonky. So I don't like to really turn with the headers, because you wouldn't do a lot of that in real life. Down anyways. You push over the grain when you turn, especially when turning into it like this. Your outside edge would push your grain down. I guess corner wouldn't be so bad because you're turning left into it. So you're kind of turning away from it. You're not turning into it. You're unalive. Is it, would it be hard to add your sawdust to like my cow, I don't know, I was saying, even if it's just for this map that I'm doing here, but I mean, would it be hard to make it, use that? But that's kind of what a lot of people around here bed with, the sawdust or sand, or maybe yours uses sand. I forget what yours uses, but the straw, I mean, it would work, but I'm just curious. How's he doing? He's doing a pretty good job, actually. Robbie's gonna have to get that outside round, but that's okay. Sand is more common over here. Oh, I didn't even see you come in. Squatch, squishy monkey. Started on start from scratch, bought a couple fields, lost loads. Swapping combines out, lost loads, figuring out pigs with mace plus. Also on the field <laughs> But you'd have to have a fill type, right? Legacy. Like you'd have to, or a, uh, yeah, you'd have to have a fill type for it. Or like a diffuse, I should say. For sawdust. There's sawdust in the game. Oh, I'm just big time farming over here. Uh, Squatch, you know, 25 foot header. 
Dairy Deer's massive New Holland chop chopper. We're big time in it. We're gonna go ahead and cut another end on this end. Just so we can get turned around here in these couple passes. Like so. I'm guessing you're building adds a fill type to the map. That's what I'm wondering. I'm guessing you're adding a fill type legacy. I've never really looked into it. I'm guessing it's probably not terrible to compute out. Ah. Seems like combines turn wonky. I don't know why. With GPS. Holy smokes, we're at 72%. It says pretty good wheat. Good work, Dale. You're doing it. Big BTF, big time farmer. I'm more like, I guess, I guess. We're going to have to get there. We're going to own this whole map. I mean, right now we own a sliver, right? I mean, we own this. I mean, we got a long way to go. What do you think? 33? That's probably got to be our next purchase. How do you make that bettable? How do you make that bettable? Oh, you mean how do you put it in? The barn is what you're asking? How you put sawdust in the barn or sand in the barn? We should be able to do it with the skill. I mean, like in real life, you'd have like a sand shooter. Or, I mean, that's what they call them, a bedding shooter. And then you fill it. You put it in. It would throw it into the stalls basically scooter super easy alright he says it's super easy I'm not saying I'm going to do it I'm just saying it would be more realistic you could use salt or straw but your schematic cell would be kind of high I, I mean, I guess they did it, so it's not like it's undoable. Got that all squared up. Go ahead and dump that. Uh... Oh, we have no end. Yeah, we need to put an end down here so I can swing that auger underneath the. Uh... I should do this in cab so you all see the animations of inside. Just whip up a sand shooter mod, that's what we need. That's what we need. We need a sand shooter mod. Oh boy. We're full? I have to pull the tractor up. It's weird to have the head on, but not the... This must not operate like my... Um, I guess whatever. Look away. We're gonna just back across our wheat with our crop, crop destruction not on. Oh, you're saying how is the barn gonna know that it's... I'm guessing that's how he has it scripted though. Scooter, I see what you're saying. You're saying like, if the barn says straw, how does it know that sand is straw? I'm guessing is what you're saying. Like how these say straw here. It would have to say sand instead. Or sawdust or whatever. Let's clip these ends. We should have done that first. I don't know what I was thinking. Whip up a sand shooter mod. Maybe, maybe, uh, maybe Legacy already has a sand shooter mod. That'd be slick. One end, two ends. Ah, let's just put two ends on it. Drive out in our nice wheat or a nice uh, alfalfa field. There we go. 
Is that what you're talking about, Scooter? Like, how's the barn gonna know that sand is sawdust? Or, sand and sawdust is straw? They're the experts. I just, like I say, I fumble around with stuff. I'm just hoping to line up a couple cubes in the blender, and that's about it. So I'm just going to grab this little jag of... Jeez, and Pete's were 9% full on just the ends. Whew. Might as well dump her before we go to the other end, I guess. So I have manual discharge on too. Yeah, I don't know. I'd have to ask them guys. I'm guessing, like I say, he has to have it scripted somehow. Hey, Jake. How are you? How are things in the Jake's world? I don't think his barn will take sawdust or straw at all. Top in this beautiful cab. Oh, we got three point. Oh, there we go. That's all I can tell. That's right. I forgot to put the hour meters in here. 3.3 .3 hours on this old girl. Hold that ladder up if we need to. I'm not doing too bad, Jake. We're just cutting a little wheat. D21's over there cutting little alfalfa. Got to be getting close to being done, I would think. Oh gosh, how do we not hit a? Oh, he's only taking 25 feet then, 24.9. Oh my gosh, when I turn the thing off. Oh man, we just lost so much straw. The cows are gonna go cold this winter. I guess I did that on the end. I guess I thought I turned it back on. Oh my, now we're gonna have to not bed the cows for a winter. Got our reel there running about right, just tipping the grains or the wheat right in. You don't want her like buried in there, that wouldn't be real realistic. Something about like that, just helping shoving her into the header, that's about it. Running about 250% motor load, that seems fine, that seems okay. check out the map how he's doing over there mowing wise he's coming right along like I said we're gonna have to clip this down here but that's fine that's fine we can get that you stream are you streaming or making videos at all Jake Let's see, how full are we? Uh, 47%. So, 49, 50%, pretty much. Huh, can we make it down and back? No. So, we're gonna have to dump, because we're gonna make it down, but then our back's gonna be a lot longer. Right, so we might as well dump. While we're at this end. Okay. 
There we go. Oh, I yeah, I get that. I can understand that. All right, let's get back here to that row. Like I said, we'll run it, and then coming back, we'll be over in the long pass. Great demand at wherever the train goes. So, Selena, so Sadea. So oh, we never did check the used market today. Oh, we got an old seventy-six hundred. Oh boy. And a Winkler grain box. We don't need either one of those things. We don't need any of those things. So we're going to check the markets because it said something's on. S something is going high. What's our wheat looking like right now? About $17 buying station. Oh, that's where you buy it. 17 18 bucks. So we're probably going to go there. We could have got 25 Oh, sand always shows. Oh. I might look into it. I don't know. Oh, there we go. Seven dollars for some sugar beets. Of course, it's sugar beets. Cotton. Um. Okay. Uh, oh, I think I wanted to look at milk. Where's the milk? See, we're right at the end there, so we gotta turn around. You guys, see how I kept a nice close eye on the combine there? There we go. I was just kind of curious if we're in the good months for the milk. We don't have any goats, but could get six dollars for goat milk. I'm not seeing regular milk. Milk. Oh, we got we got some milk. So show the fluctuate. Okay, we're we're in July. Are we in August? We're in July. Oh, so we're not even. We're in the lower end. We got about a seventy-five, about an eighty cent difference, but we're kind of in the low months for the milk. But that's okay. That's okay. The D21's over there still going at it. He's got to be getting pretty close, I would think. So yeah, we'll run this all the way to the end. Then we can fire the white up, let it go do its thing. I don't know if it'll dump both wagons. I assume so. I guess I've never actually done that. In a while, anyways. Actually, I don't know if I've ever set wagons off like this. But we'll see. Put our pipe out. Our money will go up. We need. We're gonna need some tax write-offs. Oh yeah, we'll we'll do this lot here, and then we can put our cow barn down. Even though it's still under construction, we can kind of get a feel for things. So I do kind of like this mod because it allows you to shut the header off, but it leaves the combine running. So we gotta switch to the combine. Unload that. We'll hop in the tractor here. Fire it up. See who we're hiring. Am I making small square bales? Yeah, probably some. Maybe make a load. 98% that should be good enough I sold my baler though but I'll probably have to buy one back I should buy the throw racks I kind of like the throw racks better okay there they go they're gonna go dump yep should be good oh I wanted to turn her flashers on oh I need to slow her down let's slow her down a little bit 
20 is fast enough for you, lady. There we go. Okay, and then... Where's the hazards? Oh, it says hazards, yes. Is it because it's not on the road? Does it know that? Oh, well. Hopefully she doesn't get hit on the road. Where's this fell with... All right, let's get back going. So hopefully that white will come back on all on its own. Need more grain cards? You mean hopper wagons? Yeah, I know. I do live by town though, so she doesn't have to go too far. Did she already wreck? Where is she? I would have assumed that she would have been coming right up. Or no, I guess I have it going down the main road. I should turn traffic off. Uh, otherwise, you know, you just never know. Let's turn traffic off. Let's just see. Oh god. Oh she's already oh never mind, she's moving. Already selling. Twelve more? At least twelve more I would think. Squatch, if I'm gonna make some little square bells, you wanna come sack then or is that what you're looking? Or you wanna be up in the hayloft, maybe? Yeah, we might make a load or two just for the steer barn and the little calf barn we're probably going to put down. So what I want to do, I guess I haven't really said anything. I told SimStation, but I want to make little calf pens. Not the igloos, but like little pens that will go inside a barn and then you can feed milk to them. Like get the pails. I kind of want to get to the point of like... Like what Tyson was doing. Oh, shoot. Um, like mixing milk. But I was told I have to use... I think maybe Squatch told me I have to get use... Uh, Maze Plus. I don't want to use Maze Plus. I'm trying to stay away. I mean, I have additional animals, which has added a lot of... Feed and stuff to it. Or, or uh, intake and stuff like that. If you compare this combined to what it was in 19, I mean, yeah, it's not like a JCL, everything, there's a motor and all kinds of stuff in it and latches open, but it definitely looks a lot different. I forget how I turn all them on. I think I got to turn the... I'm not on the combine. The switches all work. Header switches work, light switches work. It's definitely an improvement. Let's make a production from Alcor Place. Is that all I need? Oh, I guess I would, wouldn't I? I just have to make it like he did, make like a barrel, or just make a milk mixer. But then I have to make milk replacer. And then the production would have to have buyable where you buy water, but you wouldn't want to necessarily buy water. I mean, buy water, but you, could you add water for free? What the heck? Oh, I hit the button. Dang, I'm, in. I'm not going to have any straw because I keep... 
<laughs> I keep hitting buttons. Go figure, huh, Scooter? I just keep hitting buttons. How far back did I? Oh my. I guess not too far. Okay. Where's my wagons? Um. Did she crash? Oh, what the heck? What's your problem, person? Do, don't I have... Oh, maybe I don't... Oh, I think I have this wrong. It should be like this. Uh, pick up a field, then drop at green cell point. Ugh. Buy the powder as input would be milk replacer. Yeah, but I have to buy water too then, wouldn't I? Let's, let's chance the tracks. Oh gosh, don't get hung up on the tracks. Oh gosh, this is making me nervous. Oh, okay. Then I gotta build pens. Oh gosh. Actually, I got buckets and fill type, all that stuff. I think I got all that stuff already. I just have to... I want to make them so... I, need, I almost want to make them so they're in the map. Like the pens are. So I can have multiples of them in the same barn. Like this is what I want to do to Mercer County, but... I could start it here, I guess. Oh, now he's got her flashers on. That's kind of what I wanted to do. I kept thinking about doing that to the cow barn that's there. Like putting... Um, cap pens in it like individual cap pens but I also thought about taking uh, well I don't know how that would work I guess it would work I thought about taking this taking a lot off of it and like dividing it up and putting like say three cap pens and you could put five calves in each pen or something like that you know take the lot off the of front uh, and then have the buckets on the front so you could you drive up with your gator or whatever and then you could fill the buckets that's kind of an idea that was kind of an idea of mine or I don't know it would work that's got some good sounds I've never heard these actually good <laughs> uh, well, I'm kind of speaking out loud. I already talked about this with you, though, Sim. I mean, I I want to make some type of cap pens that actually take milk. But then, Squatch, don't you have to add it into the map? Like, let's say... Yeah, I'm trying to think of how it would work. Because you wouldn't want the... Buckets to fill up with, like, TMR... You'd want them to fill up with white milk. I assume that would work. Because that's already a fill type, right? Does milk actually have its own fill type? Can you visually see milk at all? Does anybody know? These are the things that go through my head. So anybody watching wonders what <laughs> modding stuff goes through my head? How to make this game more realistic. Oh boy, look at that. Look at that bank account. $650,000. 641000 I guess. But we should have been mowing hay. Why were we not mowing hay? Duh, come on. Let's turn that GPS off. We don't need that, right? Mow these corners out. Who's ever mowed hay? They know you just gotta come along here and... So here's your pro tip. When you get done mowing your hay field, you mow the corners out like this. And then you get rid of all your standing corners. How are you doing today, Tom McKenzie? 
Disturb has a video on how to do it with Maze Plus, but I don't know. Alright, Squatch. I, I'm taking your word for it. I heard it here. Uh, let's mow this corner out over here. Well, I'm glad you're doing good. Oop, I'm not even getting the hay. Glad you're doing good, John. Tom, sorry. I think there is a John McKenzie that watches streams too. Oh, let's just swing this puppy to the other side. Right? Okay, and that's going to mess up because we're mowing grass and hay. So it looks wonky here, but when we get into the main part again, that makes sense. Yeah, Sim, we're going to have to make like a dairy. Mega dairy. No, nah, not even a mega dairy, just a dairy. Multiplayer thingamajobber. We are all over that hitch. I would assume this would be so much easier if I had a steering wheel over a controller. What's up, doll? How you doing? What's up, uh, Urban? I seen you really. Gosh darn it. Okay, I need to get GPS hooked up here. I seen you released your uh, Molines. I think it's John McKinley. You might be right. John McKinley. Raining. Sears. Series. I'm sorry. I was trying to get... Oh, holy smokes. I'm trying to get my mower. I can't believe I just missed that. I'm trying to read and drive and... Mow that all the way out. Boom. Pick that up. Turn around. I have a bad corner here, but that's fine. We'll get it. See you later, Rev. Thank you so much for stopping by. Guys, if you haven't, and you want to check out some more of this own the map stuff Rev's been hardcore after it he has hardcore been doing the own the map challenge need help with Lua errors what kind of Lua errors hey thanks Tom I really appreciate that. Means a lot. We're, I'm just a small community, but we're growing. We're growing. Man, do I just go over there and. Yeah, we gotta get that knocked down. How did I miss that? Jeez and Pete's. So, what, we, what should we do with this? Ted it out? Should we. What are our options? What's our options with our alpha? Should we wet wrap it? Maybe we should just buy an Anderson thing and wet wrap it. I mean, look how beautiful that looks. Man, all the rows. Oh, man, it looks nice. Straight. Whew. Nothing better than some auto drive or uh, some course play. Horse play for the win. Mowing them corners out. That gets her all real nice and tidy.
Don't add loot errors, it's bad for the game. <laughs> I don't think he wants the Lua errors. Oh, I didn't mow this corner out. Dang, nabbit. What about you, doll? You seen this happen? Mowing the corners out? You guys mow the corners out like that? Holy cripes. We're up on the mower. There we go, got her swung. You said you had problems with the uh, alfalfa stuff. Sim, did you look into the like uh, fix for the bales and stuff or no? Or do it like Billy, whatever he said to do. That's kind of what I did. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy. Give me a little bit more space so I can swing it in. There we go. Real nice and tidy. No, I don't do... I don't do it like that. I keep all the wheels on the... <laughs> Hey, Freeloader, how are you tonight? Shoot, yeah, we're trying to become big time dairy operation here. So we could dump the gleaner. We could hire ourselves a worker. We can mow the rest of this hay. So we got it mowed today because it's already 150-ish. Okay, that's weird. Hopefully you guys, tell me if you can hear me. My headset shut off. I don't know why. That's weird. I've never had my headset shut off. Maybe it's telling me, it's your bedtime. Can you hear me? Okay, good. See the tigers go, oh boy. What's somebody say about YouTube? Do you know a YouTuber called Pleasant Green? No, I don't. I don't know a Pleasant Green. What's he do? Okay. Oh my. Pull that mower in a little bit. Okay, alrighty. Stop right there. Okay, we'll leave that run for a sec. I guess we got the combine still running. Oh, I've seen like, um, the, like payback guy or whatever the heck. I don't remember what his name is. Oh yeah. Oh, you first you seen it on freeloader? That's the haylage. We got haylage in there. Oh, I could put them bales right along the thing there. That'd make more sense. All right. Yeah, I think we'll be able to get two passes out of this. Uh, I'm torn. I guess we'll leave. I'll run that. We'll back this up. Turn him off. We'll finish mowing as soon as we get this combined and done.
pretty excited for some cubs. Can't imagine he will go anywhere else, Benny. Oh boy. Am I going to be cutting trees out, Scooter? Cutting the trees. <laughs> uh. Hey, see you later, Jeremiah. Thanks for stopping in. Do I have a survival roleplay series? It's just pretty much... I don't know what makes it a survival. But this is roleplayer-ish. We're trying to own the map, Tom. That's the... OTM is own the map. So we currently own this small sliver of a farm over here. And we're trying to own this whole stinking map. You just came from hauling wheat today on Grain Farm. I just don't understand why your name is so stinking long. I've seen you in other Disco or uh, servers and uh, not servers, streams and stuff. Such a stinking long name. Let's call you Rough Rider. Oh boy, I have to see what he sent me. It's uh, a little dozer, I believe. Might might have to. I don't know if the farm's gonna purchase that, but. I don't know. Rough Rider, I don't know. You could bug him about it, I guess. Oh boy. Jeez, now you're getting the scooter. Scooter special treatment. I always like the hug over so much. Yeah, so you have to give me more, Tom. I don't know what survival role play. I don't know what he's doing to be any different. Special Scooty Pooty treats, yeah. Yep, yep. Special Scooty Pooty treats. You don't want to fix it up. What? What is it? They need made to the right size. I wouldn't be that hard, scooter. Unless it messes with them, and then you're gonna have to re uh, size them in Blender. But hey, see you later, Dan. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching, Dan. Everybody, say bye to Dan. Bye, Dan. He's an IH guy, if you can't tell. I feel like we could be taking... Okay, there we go. We're getting a little bit more weed in the head. Just tell me how many bushels... What are we doing? 200 bushel wheat? Holy cripes. There you guys go. What a great, great group of guys saying bye. So, okay, now Dan left, so now you guys got to go find somebody else to replace Dan. Who, Dan? <laughs> oh, Benny. Back up there, we're going to have to unload a little bit.
One load on the back wagon. Oh, come on. Yep, I think that's what it was, Freeloader. It's all that cow manure. Oh, squared two something. Okay. Need to add characters? Why don't I buy hay from Amazon? Hmm, I never thought about it, I guess. Do they have good hay on Amazon? Oh, because they yeah. <laughs> Not bad, not bad. I, I wasn't thinking that's where that went. It was going to go, Tom. Pretty good. He's in the hay business, Benny. So yeah, what are we doing? We wet wrapping the alfalfa? Are we wet wrapping them? That would give us a lot more size, but we're probably going to need bales. <laughs> were you, Legacy, I don't know if you were on here. I don't think. Anyhow, uh, uh, FSG Tasman, I think is his name. He made the chicken bar. I don't think I have them in here. Boop, 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 boop. Um, he made these chicken barns. Yeah, he made these barns. And they're super nice. Great detail on the outside. Kind of look somewhat American. I mean, they look American, I guess. Anyhow, you can't get inside of them. And one night I was like, ah, it's not that big a deal. I mean, I don't care if you can't get inside. And everybody's like, oh my god, a modder said it doesn't matter about the details. Yeah, I think he does, Sim Station. He's out to starve everybody. It's not about the details. Two hundred bushel wheat. Gosh darn! I would love. I would plant wheat every year if I could get two hundred bushel wheat. I wonder where they get these numbers to like do this. I mean, is this what Giants says wheat should be? Is two hundred bushel wheat? Is he over in England? Is wheat that high? Who's in? Who's in chat that knows? What what does wheat yield over in England? Like I'd say eighty bushel wheat. I'd say a hundred bushel wheat around here is good. It's really good. I mean, you might get some stuff in our area. You might get a little bit higher than that, but I'd say generally it's 70 to 80 bushel wheat. Like 200 bushel wheat? Where in the heck? Yeah, where's Rev? Dick, um. Rev? Yeah, everybody over there is sleeping. It's like, what do you say, 2 in the morning or something? 3 in the morning? Hey, thanks, Triple R Farms. Sneaking in here. I don't know if you said something before. Calvin, how are you? Yeah, I can't look at how many. Ah, oh, Scooty, you don't like all those high poly trucks? Show me the high poly trucks. I don't even want to know what that Chevy that I got. That's uh, what's it bucks? I don't even know. It's probably high. Hey, good night, pickaxe. All right, now everybody say good night, pickaxe. 
He's probably gonna go drive a truck tomorrow. Alright, I started it. Oh, Calvin, you're at the, uh... How is it? How's the farm show? How is... I heard that a lot of people are upset because you can't get close to the big new case combined. Is Pickaxe real name John? <laughs> I don't know what his name is. Scooter. Like, is he, shouldn't you be building sheds right now or something? Or maybe you are building sheds right now. Um, Benny, I thought I'd seen something about it. <laughs> it's not you, get. Whoa, stop, lady. Let me fill you. Oh, my. Well, she gone. We're not going to make it 40% down and back. Well, maybe. We got a full pass there. Now ah, we got two full passes. Nope, not going to. That's going to be an extra full pass. All right, let's shut that rig down for now. Pleasant action. <laughs> What's that entitled? Pleasant after dark. How do I want to cut this? She said. Oh, I don't even. I don't even know what I said. Get back here. I want to. Did I say get back here? I want to. Oh my. You guys. Hey, you guys. And round in the circle we go. Yeah, I wish this South off was a little bit shorter. Like, this seems a little excessive to me. I mean, I guess I could technically edit it, right? If I wanted to. I don't have all the sweet buttons and steering wheel and stuff so I could, like, come and swing it to the side and then go back the other direction again. crazy how much stuff JCL's brought to this game. Guess mower's slick. Not in the corn, not in the corn, come on. Kid's super talented, and what is he, like 17? Oh, we sold some grain. Wow, 
What's the next mod you're making? Are you a modder? Yes, Tom, I am maybe what they would consider somebody who can make mods. Um, Triple R, have you seen the shop or no? Oh, we're, we're retiring? Okay. We're retiring and we're headed somewhere else to enjoy retirement. I don't actually know where Legacy if you're in where it's cold or no. Like, I'd love to move south. <laughs> Warmer area, south. Well, they said, like, maybe even around our area, but not maybe a little bit south of our area a little bit. It's supposed to get, like, eight inches of snow tonight. Like, the most snow we've had in years. Um, this would be one, the D21 would be one. I've spent the most time with it, but I would love to do the 8000 series Alice Chalmers and get them to console. I need to learn substance ban. I need to learn how to get things in and out. Snow bake up at Lake Erie. Yeah, I'm just in Ohio. Ohio. The great state. Is Fender still in here? God's country. I don't know if Fender is still in here or not. I absolutely hate snow. I wish it was like never colder than like 60 degrees. I like snow when it's not where I live. Uh, yeah, I'd say. I'm, I'm with that. I hate snow. It's just too expen it's expensive to move and then it just makes things harder to do. It just sucks. Where the heck's the white at? Why ain't he back here? Is she back here? What are you trying to say, Tom? Who are you a ch Who are your chat mod or admins? Chop mouse. Oh, you mean uh Sim Station is why. What's up, Tom? Yeah, I used to like plowing snow when I was young. Shoot, we plowed a lot of snow on the forty twenty open cab. Drive around with a glove in front of your face. Yeah, you getting a lot of... I don't know if you're still in here, J. Graham. Are you getting a lot of snow tonight or no? I think you're south of me. There's the white. Thanks for coming back. Ugh, trying to get in the header. Yeah, we do, don't we, Jay Graham? I mean, we own all the way to halfway the center of the road, so... Might as well. Yeah, I think we get this finished up. I think we get this wheat finished up, and I'm gonna... Probably kick off for the night. I thought we would get this... Dairy barn maybe placed down, but just gotta get that straw bailed. Okay, I want a clicker about right there. Nope, that's not far enough over. Think I can make this down and back in one pass? We're gonna reuse every inch of this 25 feet we got. One and a half to two. 
Yeah, I'm not sure how much I got. What kind of truck, Benny? What kind of truck guy are you? Uh, I'm trying to think what you would be. Oliver 1550. Oh boy. I use the skid loader. It's got a full cab. Super nice. Radio. FS100. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Now it's only another, what, 75 years? Are you saying like an FS 2100? Would it be? Yeah, I guess it would be 100, but. Chevy, yep, mm hmm. It was my grandpa's. Okay, so what year? What year, Benny? Three quarter ton. So you're like a nineties. Gosh, I don't know. Are we gonna be able to fit this all? It's gonna be pretty darn close. Oh one. Oh shoot. <laughs> uh. Oh gosh, the wheat's going out. Oh man, we ain't gonna clip it all. <sighs> Bad gummit. I mean, we gotta get the wheat, right? We gotta get it. Just circle back and pick that up. I got the spreader on. Oh, we don't make up some weird. we're not gonna can we scooch over you think there we go I knew we could do it I knew we could get it That's using every last inch of that 25 footer. I mean, it's gonna be tight. Maybe we scooch over a little bit more. There we go. Right, I mean, we're filling that header and some more. Gotta love farm sim logistics sometimes. I mean, we're practically running, oh boy. We're practically running a 30 footer, ain't we? <laughs> we can't keep her, we can't keep it centered up enough. go we're gonna we're just gonna leave that little tidbits whatever maybe not maybe we're gonna get it I know I did say it's too soon we made a heap of money off of this screen now what do we make off of I think it'll tell me how much it's uh, grain sold, right? 
sold products. No. Yeah, wouldn't that be? Oh, harvest income. So we're at twenty-five, twenty-four thousand. We're about full. She is about. Well, we made her. Look at that gem over there. D21 action, boys. So we'll just blow that on the ground because, like I say, I don't want to make a. I guess we could. No. If we get over far enough, we can drop whatever little bit of straw we're going to have right on that windrow. You're only making 7000 a month with 36 I got 50 I mean, day mo I guess it wouldn't matter. Yeah, I'm making, uh, well, there's my milk sale so far each month. It's about 100,000 ish, 105 to 110,000. I got 60. But also, I have like the automatic milk sale. Like, I don't think anything turns up how much the money that it makes, I don't think. Oh yeah, my cows are all um, 33 months, 29 months. I need to buy some more, honestly. 26 months. Because I found if you buy like, let's say you buy 100 of them at a time, right? So then all 100 of those are going to calve in at the same time. You're going to have like so many calves. He does have it hands in too. Oh, there you, oh, yeah. I know, uh, even um, Fender was saying that. Maybe they make it less for you console people. Nah, but Tom, uh, I don't really have a lot. I just have the guys that, you know, I know and play with, and then. I pretty much just can keep track of it. Okay, though. I think we're going to call it an evening, a day, a night. I guess it's uh, 4.30 on the farm here. But, yeah, the shop's going to be coming. Like I said, it's going to be going to probably Giants this week, next week, whatever, however you want to say it. But. I really appreciate you guys all for watching and, you know, keep your eyes out for any kind of projects I might be getting into next. So, and don't forget if you haven't hit the thumbs up and maybe the subscribe if you haven't already. And you guys have enjoyed. Have a good day.